Hey there guys, my name is Aaron and uh, today I am going to walk you through on how to install the Microsoft.NET Framework 3.5 on Windows 8.1 or Windows 8. Um, I've had some issues with this uh, primarily because of some error codes which I am going to show on screen right now. And um, I've tried uh, all the methods on the internet to try and fix this uh, but sadly none of them work. Um, so uh, I'm making this video to show you how to um, uh, enable it and if you can't enable it uh, through the control panel I'm going to show you another method on how you can install it. Now um, first things first you got to open up your control panel and head over down to programs and features and right over here you see windows features turn windows features on or off hit on that and uh, this list will show up now what you want to do is uh, if you have it if you don't have it enabled check this up and click OK and then it will ask you to uh, go through Windows updates and try and get it down but if you get this error code that I'm showing on screen right now you can try another method by using uh, uh, your install media be it the USB or your DVD or even if you downloaded the ISO from the uh, from the down upgrade ma assistant and you have it mounted on your computer so um, first things first I'm gonna go and plug in my U install USB uh, cancel I don't know why Dropbox did that but okay so you would have your install um, your install media here now what you want to do is you got you right click on your start and hit command prompt as admin get your elevated command prompt open and type in this type in this uh, this command I will also have this uh, down in the description for you to copy and paste easily so you gotta go dsim.exe online enable dash feature and the feature name would be netfx3 on and for the source now what you want to do for the source is um, in my case it is on K drive so I'm gonna put K in there if your if your drive is on D or E or um, any or J um, then you put you, you substitute K for whatever drive it is on go oops okay. then you go to sources as success and limit access now once you do that and you hit um hit enter then you'll be you'll start to install um you'll start to install the .NET framework via the uh, dsim.exe and uh, it should it should install correctly now if you are experiencing the uh, error code that is on the screen right now then um, there is a high possibility that um, the ISO file that you installed Windows with might be corrupt or in some way um, modified and so what you have to do is just um, install a fresh copy from Windows and reinstall Windows 8 and you should be all good uh, yeah for my case I couldn't install it using these two methods and uh, right at the end of it I just uh, reinstalled Windows with a fresh copy uh, with a fresh ISO downloaded from Microsoft and it worked so there you have it um, there are other methods using the local groups uh, but that sh shouldn't be the case for you and uh, this is the two main methods to install the .NET framework uh, I hope this video will help you somewhat and yeah see you